Hey guys, welcome to Excel Tutorial channel again and another episode of statistical function and formulas in Excel. So in this video, we are going to cover another important terminology in statistics, which is called standard deviation. So we will uncover the STDEV function in Excel using a concept of standard deviation, what it is and where you can use it. So keep following this video because you are going to learn so much in this video. If you haven't subscribed to the channel, please do it because we are covering each and every functionality functions of Excel in this channel. So let's get started. So here we have a very basic example just to give you an overview what standard deviation mean and how you can calculate using a simple formula called stdev in excel so first question may be coming in your mind is what is standard deviation so standard deviation is a number that tells you how far numbers are from their mean so we have already done the overview of this function in our overview video if you haven't watched that please do follow the playlist of statistical function formulas because you are going to learn so much about statistical scenarios in excel so here we have a mean one two three headers here we have a different numbers but if you can analyze this data you may find that the mean of these three columns here is the same if you calculate it by simple formula first you need to sum it up all these numbers right and divided by the number of numbers are here is four so there you go you get the mean of 15 15 and 15 so you may get by now the mean of these numbers are same here but the standard deviation it defines how far your numbers are how far your numbers this 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 and this and these numbers are from their mean so you may know by now that mean of these particular columns are the same which is 15 right so with the help of standard deviation we can analyze our numbers difference from the mean or you can say how far are numbers from their mean so standard deviation formula is very straightforward stdev is a simple standard deviation formula you just need to select all this cell here now close the parenthesis let's see the answer so it says zero why because the mean of this particular range is 15 and how far 15 is from 15 obviously it will it will be zero and same from the rest of our cells right so if we apply the same to this particular column so it says 1.154 so this is a difference is from these numbers to the mean we have calculated so mean we have calculated 15 as you can see 16 is one number behind the mean which is 15 and this particular is also one number one number and one number so one may be in the negative format one may be in the positive format but it rounded off to 1.15 or something so it will round off as a one number so hope you understand how standard deviation works and the idea behind this particular formula so if we apply the same to the this cell so you can see the numbers of in these cells are variant okay it varies from the 30 and go down to 0 and then go up to 21 then go down to 9 so you may have analyzed that the numbers are going either up and going either down it's like going up and down and creating a mountains on our graph right so here we know the mean is exactly the same 15 so it will tell how far our numbers are from our number which is 15 it says the average of is like 13.19 if you analyze that so yes it's true it's a 15 numbers away from the 15 which is 13 so it's also a 15 number away from 15 which is zero and it is away a six number greater than 15 and it's also the six number greater less than 15 so it gives us an answer of 13 which should be rounded off to 13 and you can also do that right clicking on it go to format cells and in the format cell you can just round that number just like that so you get your answer so hope you understand how standard deviation works so this is very simple and basic example but there are much more to the standard deviation because there's a variance of standard deviation like stdev.p which is for the population stdev.s which is for the samples so if you want to learn that particular functions please do 
comment in the description box because i don't think there is a demand for that video or demand for that concept if you want to learn that concept please comment box is there for you you can request it and we will make that video in the upcoming days so whenever you you find this video useful and you want to learn more about standard deviation we can make a video for you on that subject and post it also for you if you want that video please comment down in the comment box and we will create detailed video about the other functions of standard deviation in excel which is stdv.p stdv.s and other variants so if you have learned something from this video and if you have cleared out your doubts regarding the standard deviation and how to use it in excel and what does it mean so hope you i clarify that in this video so if you have learned something please click the like button if you want to subscribe to this channel please do it because if you want to learn each and every functionality of excel in detail then this channel is for you and if you want to share this video to your friend colleagues or social media and you can use the share button so see you in the next video until then bye bye